Remember that for larger fill wire, the energy must be increased to completely melt the wire. If there is insufficient energy, there may be only partial melting of the wire. As shown in the image, place the electrode at approximately a 45 degree angle at the contact location between the wire and the base material. As the electrode pulls away from the base material and the arc ignition occurs, the base material will melt first and then the wire will be melted and pushed or pulled by surface tension into the base material. This is an excellent method to produce a uniform molten pool of metal and ensure proper mixing of the base material and the fill wire.